Okay, before I start this video, I'm gonna go over a few things. If you watch the left side of your, of your screen, you see that there's like a guy that's gonna jump off the iron slide thing. And we're gonna start from there. I'm gonna do some sort of analysis um, on my PvP moments uh, with the AUG or the AUG or whatever, however you pronounce it. Uh, this character has gone to the portal, but I actually dropped down and broke my leg because my stamina was incredibly low. So maybe this this is something that you will like, me analyzing my gameplay. Uh, if you do, please comment and yeah, share your opinion. Okay, was somebody that jumped. I have a broken leg. And now I need to go because he will spell it and I'm wearing a yellow armband. He was actually not wearing a yellow arm, but it was the grass, like in front of his character, that made me think he had a yellow arm on, on. But yeah, Daisy, like, messes with your mind sometimes. This could have gone actually very wrong, because I forgot I had a broken leg. I was trying to sprint, but couldn't. If he was actually aware of, of what was going on, he could have easily killed me. So this was actually... Nothing special, but it was the start of me using like the AOG. This might be have been my first PvP kill with it, but it's a very good gun. Okay, my next thought was like I'm gonna cut up the fish trap so I can get the metal wire back. And then I can actually make a tripwire to kill his teammate that I t thought was around, but that wasn't the case. So, I'm actually stuck between doing that and trying to find cover, because this building is quite large and open, which I don't think it provides any protection from the storm. So yeah, I have to make a decision here. So we had like another AOG and a VSD, so I'm trying to get everything off his body and decide what I'm gonna keep, but I stuck with like the AOG because the guy had an insane amount of magazines for it and ammunition, and also dropped the rest to carry the, uh, the SVD with me. As you will see, I will try to snipe, the keyword is try, because I missed a lot of shots, but you can't really improve with the gun unless you shoot, right? So 
so when I approached the uh, Athena research there was a lot of gunfire going on so I wanted to go upstairs to to try and snipe but as you can see I see a landmine I'm gonna s zoom in any second now to look at the other door if there is something there I think yeah it's gonna happen anytime he's kind of slow and I do not see anything laying on the ground so okay that's fine I'm also scanning the area a bit to see if I see anybody or if I put myself in danger, you know. Maybe there's somebody watching me, you never know in Daisy. And this is also a trap that I managed to avoid because this is actually not a bad placement at all. If somebody's running up here, he will step into the bear trap. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> I did not see that landmine. The first one I saw, but that one, I zoomed in and I saw nothing, so I didn't check again. Daisy cannot decide between being glitchy and letting my character dance, by the way. This is actually the second time I survived a landmine in this building without me having a broken leg, only like damaged clothes. I don't know if, if that's the new normal, or maybe it's because of the Athena Research building, I have no idea. Also, the Athena Research for some reason does not allow good placements of tripwires, which is actually a very bad thing, because... You can actually block everything off with two tripwires or two landmines. I was lagging like crazy, I don't know if I got him. Okay, the next few s shots you're gonna see are gonna be incredibly painful to watch for any professional snipers in DayZ. I need to call like that shot and maybe ask him for a training session or maybe contact him through social media, you know, because I need it.
So after that horrible sniper experiment I headed back to the Tina Research Institute to try to get up there and kill that guy but I got swarmed by zombies. I suspected like he took care of most of them because usually when you go up there you meet some resistance you know but there were a lot more down here than I expected and of course the guy hurt me. And yeah, this could be like the Christmas event going on in DayZ, like a few vanilla community servers have it, the Nomolsk servers have it, it's pretty cool. If I get the time and chance to do it, I will do something funny and silly with the Christmas trees. Okay, at this point I knew that there was somebody else up there, like he was not alone. The question was how many? If you shoot like an unsilenced uh, assault rifle close to Tina, you're gonna get swarmed. Like, at this point I have no idea where they keep coming from, but yeah, be extremely careful when you do that. So right here I make actually the, the mistake that cost me my life. I had enough bullets and magazines so I was like you know what I'm gonna spray this fucker down. And eventually one bullet will hit but I should have gone for the nade you know. If I threw the nade to the left side to the left wall that will probably bounce a bit further and kill them. My god, how did I miss? So in a few seconds I'm gonna switch over, over to my pistol, but the server or whatever responded late. So I pressed again and that made me uh, put away my pistol again and that caused my death.
Okay, there are a few things that cause my dad. Number one, I sprayed and prayed. That's usually not something I do, but when I do it, I fail. Two, the guy was behind some lockers. Shouldn't stuff be penetrable in DayZ, or is that because Namalsk is like a modded map and maybe the lockers haven't been programmed that way? I don't know. Um, also, the lag actually, I'm not trying to make excuses, but might have gone in the way, so. I think it's mostly a mistake of me and Daisy itself, you know, the game does that sometimes, or a server, you know, but it happens, like, uh, you all, we all die in Daisy, but it's kind of sad that, yeah, I wish I, kill, I, I would have killed that guy, but I hope you enjoyed, take care, and I'll see you later, bye.